Yo, what's going on everybody? It's Trinell from the YTOS and welcome back to Sonic CD here on the countdown to Sonic Mania. Uh, we have made it to Wacky Workbench and uh, I'm actually really proud of myself. Um, I thought that this, this playthrough was going to go a lot worse than it, it's been going so far. Uh, that's, that's not to say that it can instantly just like start going terrible because this is probably my least favorite um, zone in this entire game. Just because of how random it is. Like, remember, um, if you watched the previous episodes, I did complain about the the the, the levels or whatever, like the uh, the layout of like different zones or whatever, or the level design, I should say, and how it's just so freaking random. So, like, in this in this zone, you never touch the floor or the ground. The ground is covered with this like electric bouncy shit. So you're always like up on some like crazy platform and sometimes you have to like either like use the bounciness or whatever to like get to other sides of the level or or freaking like platform like on like lower lower blocks or these like things or whatever but I actually really hate the zone very uninspired just a whole bunch of madness going on and, and then sometimes you have these like 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 right here these like streams of like ice I guess I mean you can break out of them but it's like why why though <laughs> but why though man did some of the platforms make you spin like fucking crazy it's just ugh. if we can go into the the past or the uh, future that'd be great so let's see what's up here. All right, future. I think the past is actually the one that I like as far as the music. Uh, but we may be able to make it something happen here, hopefully. No. Whoa! Let's not get hit. I mean, we don't really need rings anymore. I mean, except except to stay alive in case we get hit. But we, uh, we already have all of the time stones. So we will get the good ending, which is something that uh, I didn't think was going to happen. I honestly did not think we were gonna make it. But um But we're, we're gonna get it. We're gonna get there guys. I just fucking hate this zone. It's like look, I have to like land on something and like wait to be like carried like over say I wanna go to the right. But there's like nothing to take me there. So I had to just like bounce my way and then like just so much randomness. And then, like every so often, the, these little, these little like, and and look, what is this for? It doesn't even take me anywhere. It doesn't even take me anywhere. Like, what the fuck is the point of this? Most times when I play this zone, I just freaking like just hold right and just like hope for the freaking best. This is pretty much what you're doing. You have so many freaking dead ends. No idea where I'm going. Just ugh. and then it's, it's so, so hard to hold on to your rings in this zone. Which is why I'm I'm really glad that we got the time stones when we did. Because if I had to try and get them now, we it might not happen, boys. I'm just I'm just putting it out there. It may not have been a thing, and I can't even find I can't find anywhere to freaking time travel. So getting, I don't know how you're supposed to get a good future here. I'll have to watch like a freaking like a let's play. We might be able to get it with that by going left and right. I'm gonna, I'm gonna try it. Hopefully I don't get freaking electrocuted. Let's wait for the electrocuty shits to go. And when they're glowing like pink and like purple like that, that means you're gonna get fucking hurt if you touch it. I don't even think I can get back up there. Oh, does not look like oh okay we're back all right so we might be able to do it oh, fuck we didn't hit the damn spring you know what fuck it I, I honestly don't care I tried like I honestly think that's probably the only place that you can time travel in this entire freaking like act I really just want to be out of here and there's the goal. Thank 
the gods. <laughs> and it doesn't matter because we made a good future because we got them time stones, baby. Almost said power stones. I missed that game. All right, here we go. Act two, zone two. This is like the only cool part. That right there. Coolest part in this entire freaking zone. I wish the whole level was just like you ride this until the end and then it's over. But unfortunately, we have to time travel or we have to get through here. I think we, yeah, we can time travel here because of these things. So because of those and only because of those, we can get into the past here. Oh yeah, and this is my jam. Oh yeah, so good. <laughs> yeah, this this is the good one. The level still sucks though, but this song is awesome. And honestly, wow, that I just I landed on freaking the Metal Sonic like hologram thing from like from freaking from downtown. <laughs> And honestly, um, like I was saying, um, Act 2 is actually a lot better than Act 1, but not not by much. Um, I, I, I kind of want to just stay here. This is another place where you can time travel just because of these little circle-y things. They allow you to uh, stay at like top speed or whatever, or a high enough speed to be able to time travel. I think we're it. I think that's it. Yeah, this is a short one. You know what? I think that's why I like this one so much. It's freaking short. <laughs> Get me the hell out of here. Ooh, this is the Good Future song. Ooh, that sounds cool. See, this is how you know I've never really played much of this game because I don't I don't even remember like what the good future uh, songs sound like. This may have been I think this is the first time that I've gotten the, uh, the time stone so early. Because usually uh, around this part, I would still be trying to get the time stone, so I would still be getting like bad futures and shit. But um. We got the good future, so we're we're good. We're just gonna mess around a little bit. Let's see. Let's let's, let's go exploring. Let's go exploring. See if we can get a one man. Make that uh, that 19 extra lives a rounded 20. And why is there an F there? I don't know why there's an F there. I don't know what that icon is supposed to indicate. I don't want the uh, the fashion. It turns it turns from like a from like a a wacky workbench into like more like a, a toy shop because you have like the you know the stuff in the background it just reminds me of like a toy shop I don't know why so less of a wacky workbench and more of a, of a super colorful toy shop. Which is very cool. So I just want to get this ring. Bam. Alright, so 10 more we can get a 1-up. If there is even 10 more. Nope, we're at the boss. Alright, so this boss isn't too hard. Ow, damn. Well, I lost my shield, so that's bad. Alright, so basically what you have to do is jump on these platforms and make your way up. Without dying, because if you fall, if you fall off of those things, you die. And uh, that little electrical current that uh, that sparks up—if you touch that, you lose like all your rings or whatever. Not too hard. Not too hard. So now you have to dodge the spikes and the the platforms. But now we're good. Oh shh, stuff. <laughs> Alright, well, we died because 
I forgot that this game goes in threes. That was the, the last hit. But instead of killing him, I squished myself. That's, that's what happened. Alright, so instead of messing around and collecting rings, we're just gonna go ahead and get back to the boss. Get back to the action. Let's get back. So much bounce. Alright. That was our first death. Was that, that was our first death, I believe. Very weird music for the boss battles. I don't know what the hell the the voice is saying but I feel like it's inappropriate whatever it is it's inappropriate it sounds like he's saying work that something something I, I, I don't understand exactly what he's saying work that something something come on now I don't know I don't know what the hell he's trying to work all right let's kill this guy bam Eggman's just like dancing to the beat over there. And then he like freaking teleported out of his machine. This guy's a magician. Alright guys, that's gonna do it for Wacky Workbench. Thank you for tuning in. I really appreciate you. We created a good future. I'll see you in the next zone. This is the countdown to Sonic Mania. Peace out.